Breezy Creek Hotel oh, Hot Pool Resort. I'm uh, booked in for two days because I might as well enjoy rather than driving, right? So let's go find the off-grid campsite. $32 a night. Okay, I'm at the uh, Crazy Creek Hot Pool Resort. Going to camp here for two nights. A good spot. Should be somewhat shady. And right close to the river, which is nice. I'll get all set up. I'm going to see if I can get my awning going also. Get that up over the picnic table would be nice. Hot springs. Check that out later. I'm going to try and get uh, to the suspension bridge and waterfall for this afternoon. Maybe a dip in the hot tub later. Okay, the suspension bridge and waterfall. I had to get a ticket in the office there. Uh, the ticket with a bottle of water, $14.22. There's a path up there, but I'm assuming we go this way. But am I assuming right or wrong? Well, it goes to the same place. This one's a little shortcut. Okay, she said about 15 minutes there and then to the suspension bridge, I believe, and then 15 to the gorge. So it's going to be a good little hike. I like it. Got to go up here, right over Highway, highway 1. You crazy buggers drive! Oh, in a hurry getting somewhere. Really, where are you getting to? Nowhere. That's where. Well, here's the access. She said I wouldn't get through without my pass. Uh, must have been a budget cut. Nobody in the booth. Okay, off we go. Nice hike. Okay, I think this is down to the waterfall. First off, then I'll check out the suspension bridge. Squeaking. Saw blade. 
2014. What's going on here? I guess this is the viewing platform. This is closed off. Because to me, those are uneventful waterfalls. Somewhat rapids. The ones down below are much better. Walked up here for nothing really other than good exercise. I wish I could go further, but for some reason it's blocked off. Well, I will uh, soak in the hot tub, I guess. Try that. refreshing good soak uh, the pass was um, $48 that included a lock rental and uh, also I go as many times as I want in and out today all day tomorrow and then even the morning when I leave by noon on the 8th uh, I can come in and soak again if I want yeah very nice it's not very crowded either so that's good as far as I'm concerned. So I head back to my camp and uh, get set up for dinner I guess. Work on the internet a bit. Laugh is good. Hope it's good with you too. Now I should get the awning going. See the canvas or tarp whatever you want to call it is in good shape but the rods to hold it up weren't when I bought it. So I gotta get fix it I guess but for now redneck fix we got the tarp strap around the tree to the other side and I wanted to angle her down a bit in case it does rain and I just use a stick to support it it's already killed it's already dead don't worry I didn't kill a tree or anything so that's gonna work for me yay breakfast I mean dinner time I don't know uh, I'm just gonna use a butane outside today because it's so nice. This is normally packed down like this, so I don't know if you guys have ever, if you haven't used a Martin, but uh, fairly reasonable priced and uh, they work very well. Run on butane. So you gotta press down the lever here to engage. What am I doing wrong? I'm going to have a um, pork chop tonight. It was marinating with some spices I um, when I buy them in bulk sometimes, I put them in separate bags and I add some spices and freeze it. And the time you thaw it and this and that, it's kind of spices absorb in, eh? And I'll add a little more uh, what's the heck, heat seasoning here. Yeah, seasoning salt. It's always good. Mm -hmm. And then on the other pot there, I have uh, rice. Can't go wrong with rice. Yeah, 
Add an additional water. I don't know why I always like adding a little water. It seems like it'll make a little, little bit of sauce for me. Just a little bit of sauce. Get that rice boiled down and pork chop cooked up and I'll set my plate here and have a little uh, talk about the day and what the plans are for tomorrow and there we go we got uh, pork chop and the rice that it tasty So today uh, was a good day, no problems at all with the, with the dream machine. Uh, the drive here was uneventful, but I stopped at the um, Enchanted Forest, went around there for a while. It's pretty much it's made for a family, eh? A lot of like fairy tales and stuff set up, Winnie the Pooh and all that stuff, Stork. Three pigs, all that set up, but in the forest, which is kind of cool. But they did have a uh, path that you could hike through, also through the forest, going through the wildlife areas and whatnot. Didn't see much of wildlife except birds, but it's still very scenic and beautiful, and not much at all for mosquitoes, which is very good, also. And then the the, the uh, place set right next door to it that I was also going to check out, same thing. But it's more, it's more of a physical events like climbing and swinging and little slides for the kids and shit. Once again, it's for family, which is great, but uh, I guess i got to look at more than just a picture of a pamphlet. But anyway, it was still good to visit and check it out. And then I came made it over here to um, Crazy Creek Resort. Just driving along, I saw it. I said, "Hell, why drive for three, four hours when I can just, you know, take it easy in here for a while?" So I'm in here for two days. Uh, so far, so good. I went and seen the suspension bridge, uh, waterfall. Waterfall looked great. But I also checked out a waterfall before uh, Enchanted Forest in the morning. So yeah, it could either be a long video or I might cut it in two. Because you don't want it too long, right? And other than that, it's going good. I was in the sauna for like two and a half hours this afternoon. It's like 50, what is it? For the temperature. I think it's 40 C is the hottest one. And then it goes down to 7 C for a plunging pool. That's too cold. Well, good. So now I'm just going to relax. I have finished my meal. Maybe work on a little video or something. Clean up. And it's starting to cool down, so it's going to be a very nice sleep tonight, I can anticipate. And tomorrow's a new day. Dream that dream. Oh yeah. <laughs>